What's good, everybody? It's the one. Thank you, home to punish tonight game. Come back here again. Some more Apex Legends. Salute to my new subscribers. My Sunday, uh, turn your subscribers. You already know what it is. We got socks on real quick. And now, this is me playing with Rampart. You know, just doing my thing with her. Getting some of this backup content out the way. That way, I can have more room to make more videos and all that shit. But, the main thing I want to say is, I appreciate y'all very much. All the love support y'all show me over the years, with just about any of the content I put out there. Shorts, long form content, I have been kind of sitting on some content, and also I was putting out quite a bit of shorts to help my views go up, but now I'm working on getting my watch time up, because I'm about like... 2,800 watch hours away from being baby monetized and I'll say about like 3,000 away from being fully monetized as far as you know watch time hours is concerned I still need you know the, the extra 400 and something for full monetization period but I'll work on that part when I get there this is mainly like a video to say, I will be live, not tonight, but soon. Give me like a day or two. I'm waiting for Modern Warfare 3 to go on sale. Then I'll get that out. Oof, get shit on mobile. Man, I fucking miss arenas, god damn it. See how juicy this is? Why? Hey, why respawn? Why did you have to get rid of arenas? I love arenas. That T T um shit is garbage. There's too many people on the field. It's too many. Like a five on five would be nice. A four four on four or five on five. That would be cool. But a six on six is uh, for, for these maps. These maps don't really suit T D M in my opinion because they're not really made for them. Cause that's just too many niggas running around and you always get third party. Cause motherfuckers just be bullshitting half the match and then just see their teammate getting shit on and then they come it's like me two, maybe three people come up. I'm like, bro, fuck all that. Put me back arenas, man. Cause the arenas I ain't gonna lie. It's the most fun I've had in Apex since the game came out. Back in February twenty nineteen. But now that arenas is gone, I'm just like, bruh, this, it don't hit the same, in my opinion. It really don't. But I'll still be playing this. You know me, I'll be playing it off and on. And give me all this juicy content and all that. But it's just like, god damn, bruh. Y'all doing all this extra stuff. But late. Like, y'all give us non-stop bundles and all this other shit nobody really asked for and also the buff the goddamn light ammo like that shit just feels weak as hell like why did you switch the, the spitfire to light ammo that shit broke breaks my heart man like the spitfire needs to stay in the heavy ammo section. Why can't you just switch something else <laughs> to the fucking light ammo section? Because the Spitfire, no, I feel, don't belong there. The Fitch Spitfire is a strong weapon, but you switch it to light ammo, now the shit shoot bees. So either you switch well, Spitfire back to heavy ammo, and you switch another gun out for that. Or, you know. Buff the fucking light ammo. Make it hit a little bit harder. So it's not like I'm shooting motherfuckers with the whole magazine. And then have to switch to a different gun just to take a motherfucker out with it. Or I had to hit him with something like... I would say... Hit them for about... Depending on you know what type of armor they got. Let's say if they got purple armor. So I gotta hit the motherfucker with... About... 200 damage with light ammo and switch to my heavy ammo which would be probably like the Havoc or something 
and then finish them. I'm like, what the fuck sense does that make? Like, I don't know. The, the, the decisions these motherfuckers make at respawn just make make my brain hurt to even think about it. But the main thing I want to say, as far as this clip is concerned, is I miss arenas. I understand that not that many people played it. And like, you know, it was like one of the lesser played modes, but I'm like, bruh, that's mixtape shit is garbage because control is just, I can't fast, really. That's really all they do is fucking camp. I'll try to spawn trap you. It's one or the other. It doesn't really matter which. So that shit is a wash for me, personally. Because like, when I'm not in the mood to deal with ranks, and you already know how <laughs> pubs be. They be hidden sometimes and sometimes they don't be hidden because, you know, randoms be doing random shit. Which you will see in the next section of this video. I mean, goddamn. Ooh, this shit's getting on my nerves, man. I love Apex, but goddamn, these dads be doing stupid shit. Especially shit we don't be asking for. Oof, they lo lost the teammate, damn. I know how that feels, because when my team gets shit on, it's either I'm leaving, or one of my teammates leave, because shit. When you play the arenas, and off, and you get bots on your team, I mean, shit, it's going to be rough trying to make a comeback. I've done it before with just me and another teammate against a whole squad, but that shit ain't easy, trust me. It's not easy. By any means. But anyways, moving on. It's just... Oh, what will se season 20 be like? I don't know. I know they're thinking of a new legend to bring out. But I'm just like, bruh. Instead of just giving us a new legend, how about you give us a new game mode? Like a new permanent game mode. Or something. Something that really switches the game up to make it feel like something's different. Something's going on, you know. There needs to be more going on with this game. Like, it's still going to be flowing and shit with the player base being where it is. But I'm just like, bro. <sighs> this game. I don't know. I just... I just feel personally like there needs to be a lot more going on. Because you can give us all these different events and this and that, whatever. I don't even care. It's not like I'm going to be, oh my god, I'm just so one with joy that this game is just, you know, popular. I don't give a fuck about it being popular. That's never been a concern of mine. What's been a concern of mine is that. Team balancing makes more sense than it does currently. Um, hmm. Another thing that really concerned me: fix the fucking footsteps. Now we've been saying that since season zero. They still ain't worked on that, and it's been 19 seasons. I'm like, bro, yeah, my fucks is tripping. Another thing that's been irking the shit out of me: I don't play that much besides the solos, because you already know how I feel about that. Not being there. And this nonsense. Oh, this is a team boost game. Oh, man, blow me. Fucking blow me. But. Another thing that you know, annoys the shit out of me with this game. Currently. Is just like. Where the fuck. Is my goddamn. <laughs> Rampart. Prestige skin. Because I know it's going to be like what. Maybe two more characters that get it before she do. Like, are you guys basing this solely off, like, popularity, or is it random? Like, is there something going on to where you guys just, like, you know, pull shit out of your hat and make, like, you know, give us a little something here, a little something there, but it's not fully... See you later, bang. I don't know. It's just confusing me how they do this shit, but... I would love to know. I would love to know. Also, 
What's up with the dive trails? Are they gone forever? Or are they just gonna be solely based upon if you get um prestige skin or not? Also, why the hell it takes so goddamn long to get an heirloom shards? Like that shit's ridiculous it takes so long. So, teammates. This is what I was talking about. Fucking teammates ran off without me. And then they get shit on. It's like bro, don't leave your fucking team. Don't just do whatever you feel like doing. I have no choice but to take them all on. Watch this bitch right here. Are you serious right now, bro? Exactly. Now I gotta fight a whole fucking team because these motherfuckers wanna leave. And they stupid asses wanna run over there in the first damn place. Now I gotta man up and body all three of them. Hell, four, really. And there's another dude from an opposite team. You'll see. Get this fool out the way. Get your ass out the way. Mm -mm -mm. Look at that shit. See what y'all niggas have me doing? I gotta do all this work. And all you motherfuckers do is run off and die. Like, what the fuck was the point of that? Why would you run away? Away from me, your teammate, just to get shit on. And then you go be a super safe hub and go down to. I'm like, bro. These teammates, man, I swear. These motherfuckers just ain't got no type of situational awareness. They ain't got no real skill to really make sense of like these badges they be having a lot of folks be having master badges diamond badges and this and that but yet they be having this massive fucking ego like oh i can ch i can let me say it with um, my white boy voice i'm gonna ego child this guy bro i'm gonna go i'm gonna go get shit on hey man where the fuck you at bro revive me revive me bro come on revive me what the fuck you doing i'm like nigga you the one that went down your stupid ass went over there, an eagle child, two on three, and got decimated. I didn't tell you to go over there. Now you want me to waste my life to go get your stupid ass? No, nah, nigga. That's not how this works. I won't always be here. Just like Crypto be saying. I'm like, come on. Y'all motherfuckers got to be paying more attention. No when to fight, no when to back off. Most importantly, don't leave your fucking teammate when the nigga needs you. See? He should have followed me. Why didn't you follow me? Stay where I'm at. Don't go far. Don't go too far. Watch this. Bruh, who told you to go over there? You don't know how many people are over there. Oh, I swear to God, bro. That's how I feel. I feel like I'm LeBron right now. I'm the MVP, and my teammates constantly doing super shit. And now I'm getting shot by two different teams. I can't defend all these motherfuckers by myself. Thank you, Mirage. Thank you. Fucking dumbass teammates, bro. I swear. But anyways, it's Punch Night Gaming coming out. Man, these fucking teammates get my nerves.